My name is Pal. I'm with El Rio Berry Farms. Uh, we're out here in Oxnard uh, in the Ventura County and uh, we, grow, we grow all strawberries. We grow all conventional strawberries. We have two different ranches. This ranch uh, is 40 acres and then we have another ranch that's 60 acres. And um, we have the tensiometers on one on each ranch right now but uh, we originally had both on this ranch to be able to see uh, the difference between the two different soil types that we have on this one ranch. It's a really big deal. I mean, we all know how important the water issues are in California right now. And for us personally, um, before we started using a irrigation management program, we just kind of gone off of prior experience. You know, we've got, we've got irrigators who've been out here for 20 years doing it the same way for 20 years. And uh, I, mean, I mean, there's been changes for sure, but you know, they they've, are really set in their ways about things. And uh, our first year of using an irrigation management program, not just the, the tensiometers, but uh, really monitoring how much water we're using and being conscious of that, we ended up saving 27% of our water in the first year from the first season. And uh, that was in a dry season. So the, the amount of water we're, we're being able to cut back is, is dramatic. If all the farmers could cut back 20%, I mean, that would, that would be huge. That would be really significant. And uh, the tensiometers really lend a lot of ease to the, pro to the process. We're able to uh, sit on a computer and be anywhere and see how much water we need for the next day, you know, and, and uh, the amount of control that it gives us for our, our irrigation management program is really, uh, is really nice. You know, we can just call up our irrigator and say, hey, either water tomorrow or water tomorrow for an hour and a half on this side and not on the other side. And uh, it, it's great that, that we can kind of micromanage that, that well remotely. Some other benefits that I've seen from our tensiometer is that we also use it for our frost alarm. Um, it's got a thermometer on it that is used for soil tension or, or soil temperature and uh, we keep it on the surface and we use it for uh, monitoring the air temperature and when the temperature we can set what range we want it to give us a phone call on our cell phones at any time and uh, it seems to be working out pretty well for us that way. It's good too because we've got some analog thermometers in the fields and so I'll drive around and I'll check those but then I can go in the office and then check the website every 15 minutes it lets me know the temperature changes and what's good on that is that it gives you a graph that you can see um, with the temperature so that way when you can see the trends when the when the temperature starts falling quickly you can see oh it's gone from this temperature to this temperature and it's still going down I better go kick on the wind machines and the same goes for um, the same goes for the water uh, tension too being able to look back at the old information and see the graphs and see the trends as far as the as how much water is in the beds to know if we've been consistently watering an, uh, an accurate amount. For this ranch um, especially it's really nice to have more than one tensiometer out here. Uh, we have two very distinct soil types and it's pretty much right down the middle and uh, those different soil types run along our um, ability to separate the irrigation into two different sections as well. Um, we, have to, we have to water a, a half of the field at a time because of our pump and, uh, and the lines are, are broken down along those, those soil types. And uh, for instance, our sandy side needs uh, less water at one time but more often. And the clay side needs more water less often. And so uh, it's a little tricky to figure that out, but uh, when you do, the tensiometers make it really easy. They help out a lot right there. What I really like about the Hortau is that it's been really, it's been, it's been the most used tool for our water management program. We can check it daily and it's, it's so easy. Um, the website helps out a lot. We had considered using the analog tensiometers uh, for a while but to go around and collect the data yourself uh, it's more time than I've got to, to put into that. And I mean, you know, perhaps you, train, so you could train somebody to do that and it definitely could be done with a, with a clipboard and, and enough time. Um, but for us, 
it's it's saves us time that way and we can still get the information that we're looking for on a daily basis.